Welcome to Melon Kitchen. I'm so excited that you're watching today. We are going to be making some chicken flautas or rolled chicken tacos. They're made with flour tortillas. I like to use the tortilla land tortillas. They are a flour tortilla that you keep in the refrigerator. And then when you're ready to use them, you bring them out and fry them on the stove top in a fry pan. They have a great flavor and freshness about them. They're not too thick, so they are great for this recipe. And this recipe makes about 12 flautas, so it's a great meal that you can have for a family or you can have extras for lunch the next day if you make it for dinner. We are going to use some sour cream and mayonnaise for our filling. You could use just sour cream if you wanted or just mayonnaise, but I like to use a combination and a rotisserie chicken that I just shredded right off the rotisserie chicken and some cheese. So the seasoning I put in is cumin, paprika, lawry's, garlic salt, which is my favorite garlic salt. I love the balance it has with the salt and the garlic and some parsley. I'm going to add in some chili powder as well. Then we're going to give this a quick mix and we're going to add in our cheese. I like to use the Mexican blend that's pre-grated that you can find at the store. You could also use pepper jack or medium cheddar, any cheese that you enjoy pretty much and give it a good stir. Then mix that together with the chicken then we're going to fill our flautas. To make sure that you don't overstuff them, so start with a small little scoop in the middle. Taking the tortilla from the bottom, move towards the middle, then tuck under the chicken mixture. Then you're gonna finish rolling to the end of the tortilla. Next, we're going to place the flautas in a greased 9x13 casserole dish. This recipe makes about 12 of them. I just give it a quick spray. I like to use the avocado oil from Chosen. It has a nice mist. It's just my favorite to use. I also spray some on top of the flautas. Baking them in the oven is... My preferred method. You could also fry these, pan fry them if you wanted to, but I like to bake them. They take about 20 to 25 minutes in the oven on 350. And they come out nicely, lightly browned, really melted in the middle, and they're just delicious. You can dip them in guacamole, salsa. I like to have some pickled jalapenos with them sometimes. And that's it. Thank you so much for joining me today on Melon Kitchen. I hope you'll give this recipe a try. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up below. That really helps out the channel. And I upload on Monday and Wednesday. I share family-friendly recipes and grocery hauls. So go ahead and click the subscribe button and hit that notification bell if you'd like to receive notifications when those come out. I'm super excited for the things I've got coming up for you guys. And I'll see you next time.